Nice <laughs> trash can. Now that's some dust. Don't worry, we washed our hands off screen. Boop. All right, so our first recipe we're gonna do is a together breakfast. It's a different different take on it. Instead of us taking like freezer frozen waffles, we're gonna we're gonna make a Belgian Liège waffle. And basically, what that means is we're just gonna do a high yeast, uh, high rise dough. Let's get started. Let's take this mixing bowl <laughs> first. <laughs> now, what we're gonna do: one cup of sparkling water. Now the sparkling water, what that's going to do is it's going to help the yeast rise faster and it's going to just add more air into it. So, Perfect. I'll let you do the honors. Okay, all right. Just one cup? Just one cup. All right. You going to strain there? Yeah, strain in there. Okay, just got to make sure. <laughs> no, for sure. Just don't want to get start off on the wrong foot. Uh, <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, you topped it off. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Okay. Some bubbly. Some bubbly. All right, what's next is we're gonna add two eggs. Now these have to be room temperature because if they're not room temperature, if you have cold eggs, the yeast isn't gonna rise. So all these, like even, even with the sparkling water, it needs to be room temperature as well. The more you know. The more you know, right? Oh, There's some eggs good for you. Good to know, thank you. I'll crack one too. All right, all right cool. And then we're gonna add uh, three tablespoons of granulated sugar. And this can just be any type of sugar you guys want. One, two, three. Perfect. And then next we're gonna add, we're gonna add a half teaspoon of salt. We're gonna throw that in there. And then we're gonna add a packet of this dry yeast. Now you don't need a lot of dry yeast. You only need about two and a fourth teaspoon of this dry yeast. No smell yet? No smell yet. <laughs> Pour that in there. That looks good, actually. Yeah, <laughs> I'm ready. And you're just gonna mix this. Oh, up. it kind of looks like the. Okay. Oh, by the way, <laughs> check that out. Real cool. What about some fusion cuisine? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And you're just gonna mix that up till everything is beaten. Wait, no. It's cool. You can like see it like foaming. Yeah. Oh, so once it foams, then it's good. <laughs> ah, nice. Yeah. And now, next thing, we're gonna add four cups of flour. This can be all-purpose flour, unbleached, please. And you just throw that in there. All good. And we're gonna melt some butter. So you can do this on a stove top. You can, I'm just gonna microwave it. <laughs> That's room temperature butter right now. There you that's, go. That's real butter. <laughs> and that should be good. And after after you're mixing, we're gonna slowly add in the butter. With the pearl spoon. Oh yeah. <laughs> pearl. Hopefully she would approve of this consumption of food. She'd probably be freaking out. Oh <laughs> As I'm pouring it, you can just mix it. Ooh, that smells good. It does. It's a little nice. butter. Oh yes. You know this takes a little bit of uh, elbow grease. Usually you would use a mixer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just using Grace's arm, so that's oh, good. Amazing. <laughs> well, you know what? I can use an arm workout. I have I have twig arms. She's getting swole. Yes. Like swole for the summer. Like the John Cena meme. Oh gosh. <laughs> I will never live that down. <laughs> if you guys don't know, there's this uh, interview that she did. It was Sorry. Animate Miami. Yeah, it was like um, screaming John Cena. It was like after the, like, uh, there was like a John Cena prank call that went viral. John Cena! <laughs> you know what? It's a little stale at this point. It's a For bit sure. of a stale meme now, but at the time it was very fresh. So after churning the butter, <laughs> we're just gonna. Oh, you gotta get, slowly get in there. Yeah, we're gonna get in there. So basically, you're gonna keep going. If you have a mixer, it'll it'll just mix itself and it'll be a wad of dough. Now, if you're hand mixing this, you're just gonna want that wad to look like that. And you have dough. Amazing. <laughs> okay. That's dough. Now, we're gonna let this sit for about an hour. You're gonna put saran wrap over it and we're gonna just let it rise. One hour later. 
So after an hour, you're gonna take the dough out and you're gonna mix in raw turbinado sugar. What this sugar is gonna help do is it's gonna help crystallize the crust of the waffle. Now you're gonna cut it into little chunks so that you can get nice little waffle kind of pancake looking things. And you're gonna mix in little chocolate chips or whatever you like. And when you're done, you can just put these bad boys in the waffle iron. Hey, Steven Universers. <laughs> we did a chocolate chip kind of mixed medley thing. And we have the ruby rhubarb uh, jam. Basically just throw this all together. Yeah. yeah. I think we should start with the syrup. Okay. <laughs> just do a drizzle on top. Bam. It's not even open yet. Ooh, brand new. Brand new, wholesome. Wholesome. <laughs> Not very wholesome. That's all right. If every pork chop were perfect, <laughs> we wouldn't have hot dogs. Yes. How much syrup did the show put in? I, I mean, it's Stephen we're talking yeah. about. I mean, I feel like that isn't even like That's enough for like the up. bottom yeah. ones. Oh yeah, in the middle. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, oh okay. There you go. Yeah. And then I vote. Yeah, rhubarb. Yeah. Each stack. I'm like trying to like art direct this like <laughs> <laughs> this masterpiece. Yeah, that looks good. Whipped cream. That looks so good. Yes. Okay. Sweet. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> so maybe a few pieces of yeah. strawberry. Twin Peaks. Yeah. Exactly. The popcorn. You know, I've never tried popcorn and waffles before, but I'm gonna give it a shot for this. I think this is a first for me for it together, but this is well. I mean, now I'm like thinking this is just gonna be really daunting to eat. I'm like, yeah. how am I, where am I even gonna start? I think this is a tapas kind of food. Kind yeah, of food. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just sticking some of the pieces of popcorn into the back of the whipped cream here. I'm like, <laughs> it's like glue, it's great. <laughs> And then all we need is to add more syrup. I think that's a great idea. I think that's all you need. Yes! <laughs> should I add more whipped cream as well? I think you should. All right. Oh, whoops. Perfect. Oh! oh! <laughs> perfect. That's perfect. <laughs> it's done! Ta da! Ta -da! <laughs> okay. That's delicious. Mmm, that's so good. That's actually really good. That's so good. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, if you guys like this video, comment the link below. And follow her on her Instagram at grace.rolik. Uh, or Twitter. Do you got a Twitter? I got a Twitter. It's grace underscore Rolik. Shaking <laughs> it up a little bit. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks. This is actually really good. It was really good. I, 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 I made it. <laughs> <laughs>